<clears throat> Good morning, America. Are we still allowed to say that? I sure hope so. Anyhow, what are we doing today? Today is, what is today? Today is July 11th, 2020. Current temperature is 88 degrees, supposed to get to 93. That's Mississippi 93, not Nebraska 93. 93 here means hot and sweaty, okay? What are we doing anyhow? I have been commissioned by a very good friend, a uh, feller I made a headboard for him, kind of like ours. Um, today we are going to work on a smoker cart. He's got one of those stand-up uh, propane uh, smokers, you know, square, rectangular smoker with the propane bottle on the side. We're going to build a cart for that. This is the picture he sent. Let's see if we can get that in there. I don't know how well it's showing up. We're going to build something similar to that. This here looks like it's two by fours and plywood. We're going to try to beef it up a little bit, make it a little bit nicer, finish it out. Uh, so we're going to get started. We went to Lowe's last weekend, I think got the boards for it and I ordered casters off of Amazon I think I got three inch casters off of Amazon for they were about 25 to 30 bucks for a set of four two stationary two swivels with locks all right so uh, I'm not gonna show you every screw I'm just gonna build some show you what we got how we do it we'll go from there I'm gonna drink me some iced coffee, manly iced coffee. Is iced coffee manly? I don't know. What would John Wayne say? He'd probably slap me in the face. All right, here we are. All right, so we are picture. four. I got picture. you. I got you. Click picture taken. Okay. We are four foot by two foot. Those boards in the middle are 21 inches, picture. giving us two foot across, four foot wide. All right. Now then, I've got some marks here, right here. And right here, these are where our boards are gonna come up to make our brace or our shelf that goes across the bottle. All right, so the measurements on this smoker are 21 inches wide by 30 inches across, okay? So this first line is 32 inches. I'm giving roughly one inch on each side for this smoker to sit on, all right? Okay, so I'm going to have supporting boards right here come up and up here. My helper makes it hard to think. There's a little joke if you ever, uh, uh, for the Titanic, let's see if I can remember this. There's a mime, if I can find it for the Titanic, I will put it right here. Okay, you'll get it. All right, so next, so this is the base. A uh, propane bottle is slightly over 12 inches wide and close to 18 inches high. So you've got to compensate for that. All right, so my next shelf, the bottom of it has to be 
more than 18 inches high. You got to have room for that regulator and all that for the screw in for the LP line. So we're going to have to compensate for that. I'll try to do those measurements somewhere where it's nice and quiet and I can think. So anyway, next is going to be the support boards. I'll get those cut, I'll get those screwed in, and I'll give you the measurements for that. All right, here's what we got. I've got four boards that are going to support the next shelf. I made them 34.5 inches. That will give me clearance for the bottle and make a shelf that is roughly three feet high off the ground once this is complete. All right, I went ahead and put one board on the end, 21 inches, just to square the frame up. Okay, so it's all frame, it's all square now. I'm going to have my assistant, Stephanie, help me uh, level these boards square for the uh, support for the frame. Uh, she's gonna do that off camera because she's naked right now. All right. All right, so here's what we got. I made these 34.5 inches tall to compensate for the bottle. It'll give me uh, plenty of room for the bottle on the inside. All right, so now I made the top shelf. I have got these boards right here are 20 inches long. The inside boards are the same. They're 21 inches. So that will make this top 20 inches by 24 inches. And it is going to go on. Top of this and I will screw this down this will give him a nice tabletop to put ribs on whatever else he's smoking nice prep area and the smoker will be sitting here the bottle will be under here originally I was gonna make it where the bottle went into the front but with the board size the way they are the bottle will go in the back I'm gonna screw this down and then we'll get started on boards across the bottom here. All right, here we are. I went ahead, the next step, we screwed the top in. I went ahead and did my boards on this section. So the base of the smoker is 30 inches wide, so the base will fit on there, on uh, evenly on those boards. Those are the most important. Then I've got space boards in between, All right? I messed up. These boards right here, I made 34.5. I should have made them 30.5. Somehow I, uh, I calculated for the wheels, but then I turned around and didn't calculate for the wheels. So the wheels are three inch casters, but the base makes them four inches. So for me, this is a little bit too tall. This would put the top shelf at roughly uh, 36 plus 4 would be four, blah, 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 40 inches. Duh. Okay. But lucky for us, this guy is 6 foot 4, so it may even be better for him. So he'll have a 40 inch platform to work off of. All right. Uh, we're going to build a mini frame on the inside and wood it so that the propane tank and sit on the inside and then I'll probably do some slats on the sides and right here all right that's the next step all right here's the next step I had to move outside because my helper is taking a nap and I couldn't be loud hammering and screwing so we brought it outside what we've done is made a two by four inner frame and then I took, cut some more two by sixes. They're gonna lay on top. Let's see if I can get this in here. These are gonna lay in here flush. Like such in the propane bottle will sit on top of those. 
All right, we are done. Let me show you what we finished up with. I got it flipped over. Let me get out of the shadow here. So I put two boards here. The propane tank is going in here. And then on the inside, I put two more boards. Okay. The only other thing I had to do, okay, this is the bottom side. There will be caster wheels that go down in the corners. The only other thing I had, those were already, those are already good for uh, caster wheels with what we've built. The only other thing I had to do is right here, I had to put some two by fours for the caster wheels to bolt to, screw to. All right, so we are done. Let me put this down. See if I can get this on camera. That's what we got. Smoker will sit here. Propane bottle will go inside. So the next phase, next stage is to sand it. And we're going to stain it. A dark, uh, the color I got was a navy. Even though it looks more blackish than navy blue. He said he wanted it black colored. So that's the best I could get. We're going to stain it that color. And then we'll throw the casters on and go from there. What we got on there, Jim? All right, on the top we got uh, skillet potatoes going. Uh, some sweet corn. Next row down is what they call armadillo eggs. Jalapenos stuffed with cheese wrapped in breakfast sausage. Below that, I got a pork shoulder and a couple of pork tenderloins. And then just a water pan just to help keep things uh, moist. Uh, iron skillet with a couple of wood chunks in it and the burner. What kind of wood you got on there today? Uh, I have got a hunk of mesquite and a hunk of apple. All right. Just kind of add different little flavors. All right, folks, here is the finished product. So last time you saw this, it was in bare wood. Uh, I added some handles out of plumbing pipe. I added a, uh, let's see if I can get that on camera, a bottle opener, and we stained it. Right there is the propane tank. I did run a board across the back just to hold the tank in. And that is it with the smoker on it. To meet your approval? Yes, sir. Absolutely. More than I wanted. It's great. All righty. And here in a minute, we're going to uh, christen it, I guess you'd say. We're going to use that bottle opener to open a beer. But that is it. All right, come over here. Come over here. Out of the way. All right, folks. Here we have a uh, Sierra Nevada Summerfest Chris Summer Lager. This is going to be the first first uh, bottle opened on this unit. Go ahead and have at it, Mr. Jim. You want to move your head out of the way? <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Not bad. Thank you for watching. <laughs>